Today we will take a look at the new Gorilla Finger Engineering Kit. To select the plate, think about what object you want to handle. In this case, the round pumpkin is best handled with a centric soft actuator. After you have selected the plate, you need to connect the fingers to it. Be careful not to tighten the screws until you have adjusted the fingers to the size of your product. After connecting the fingers, you can use your object to give the gripper configuration its final form before tightening all screws. The larger fingers are designed for handling bulky, large and heavy goods, as well as nets and bags. Like this smaller finger version, this kit comes with fingers, a set of plates and a universal flange adapter that fits most robot models. By the way, you can find the video on how to use the smaller fingers on our YouTube channel or in the description below. But let's focus on the Gorilla Finger soft actuators presented here. Next, connect the flange adapter to the gripper. Our fingers are pneumatically actuated. Compressed air and vacuum must be supplied through hoses. The hoses are connected via the fittings on the top of each finger. Make sure to read the manual to select the air pressure you need for your application. After we connect the air supply to the gripper, we can test our configuration. Looks good so far. This one looks good, so let's mount this soft actuator to the Delta robot. After connecting the gripper to the Delta robot and reconnecting the air supply, we can do our first tests. We hope this guide helps you choose the right gripper for your job. For more information about the Gorilla Finger soft actuators, the engineering kit and other products, please visit our website, email or call us and we will make sure you get the tool you need.